Uh, bro, Thurman Murphy, Dr. Kim Bill, the Hammond Doc. I'm going to show you my brother label maker. This is it right here. And um, I've used this to make labels for my parts. Drawers here. And you can make uh, labels for whatever you need them for. So, for example, uh, we were talking about you're making a label for, to distinguish between the 122 and the 147 input plug areas. So, all you have to do is turn on the machine. And then I'm gonna clear it here. It's like, you know, computer type typewriter. And then type what you want to type in. You can change the font size, and you can do all kinds of things here. Um, you can change the kind of font that you have in there. But I'm just gonna do something basic. Let's see. Uh, let's say Leslie. Space 122. So I want to make that say Leslie 120. I hit print. Watch what happened. Hit print again. Hit print twice. Sends that label out. You push this little button here, it clips it off. <laughs> and look at what it says Leslie 122. Then all you have to do is take your little label that you made and go back in the back of it peel that paper off of it it has the sticker sticky part on the back and then you can stick it on to whatever you want to stick it on to stick it on here there you go yeah that's it <laughs> So, that's all it takes. And you got, you can label whatever you want to label, man. Uh, you got test equipment you want to put your name on. So, rather than writing stuff out with your hand or trying to type out something on a, on a computer and cutting it out, just use the label maker. They're not expensive and easy to find at Office Depot and Staples and places like that. All right. So I hope that helps you. Doc Kemp, the Hammond Doc. Peace out.